Last week, I received a letter from my brother. Dearest sibling, I have discovered a secret so dark and ancient that it rivals the worst of my nightmares. I know its location, but I will only tell you what you absolutely have to know. Come quickly to the Plastic City that arose like Atlantis from the depths. The Plastic City, like our planet, is dying. In time, it will sink again back into the dark below. I know you want to save this world, and you will find your answers here. I leave you the family jade amulet. <sighs> May it bring you better luck than it did me. secret place, I could immediately sense the anxiety in the other crew. It came as no surprise when the captain told me that I had to make the rest of the trip by myself. He gave me some supplies and told me they would wait two entire days for me to return. I said, it won't take that long. He told me, no one who has gone to the Plastic City has returned. I rowed the small boat towards the shores of plastic that were waiting for me. On the shores I saw some twisted beings, twisted in plastic and frozen like statues stuck in time. It was beyond words and invaded my mind. I could almost recognize But the things were all plastic All dead And staring at me With their blank eyes Was the hope Just a lie All these twisted creatures Some already long gone Some still slowly dying I walked deeper into the plastic nameless city as they stared at me. I walked past structures and buildings, at least I assumed they were buildings. The plastic covered most everything. Whatever these structures were, they were not built for people. The doors were far too small and narrow for a human being to stand in. What was this ancient place before the plastic killed it? What I imagined was the heart of the city. It was a large temple-like building, decorated with seashells so large they had no earthly reason to exist. There, I saw the old queens of whatever this city used to be. A siren so decayed with the plastic, she didn't speak. The other, some sort of strange bug-eyed being that resembled a human, but but not quite. It... It spoke to me. We are your foremothers. You have come from us. We were your keepers. And we have been hushed. To show you Your pollution has made us weak And now the plastic city And 
Then it was silent, and it faded from existence, leaving a dark black void. I swear, I could hear my brother's whispering voice. There's no hope left. No hope left. I awoke in the boat off the shores of the plastic city. I watched as it slowly sank back below the waves. My family's amulet broken. The color had faded from it and the world around me. Now there was no hope left. I looked at my arms and hands and saw in my own horror the plastic was consuming me too. Plastic world in this plastic.